NFT. Not for me. 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 Crypto winter is still out there. Safe investments such as Celsius, Anchor Protocol, UST, Stables have gone downhill, have gone to zero. People don't know if they're going to have access to their money again in Celsius network. Loads of uncertainty in the air. This is the time where people leave the crypto market. And in the next cycle, when things start picking back up, people will come back to the market again. BTC just broke below the last cycle's all-time high a few days ago. We seem to have a relief rally right now with BTC up 20% since its low two days ago, above $20,000 again. Is it a dead cat bounce? I don't know. It could be. It could be the bottom. Time will tell us. Miner sales has been accelerated. They have sold over $140 million worth of Bitcoin in May 2022. So if you believe in crypto long term, this might be an amazing opportunity to dollar cost average into BTC and crypto again. A few months ago, people were saying, oh, I wish I had bought it cheaper, had bought it at that price. You might have this opportunity right now in front of your eyes. But hey, it's very hard to be greedy when everybody's fearful, right? Hi everyone, what's going on? My name is Carlos. I am a normal guy talking about crypto on the internet, trying to make wealth for my family, sharing my path, sharing my thoughts. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you the list of the top 12 crypto billionaires. Yes, in spite of all this blood that has been on the streets, a lot of people are still crypto billionaires and there is a trend uh, among those guys. And by the way, Forbes has made this list and I am simply sharing it with you. Who do you think is on this list? Do you think Michael Saylor is there? Do you think Elon Musk is there? You might actually be surprised. Check the list out. In the 12th position, we have Matthew Rosak. Rosak is the co-founder and chairman of Block, which is a blockchain technology startup that consults on projects such as helping banks store digital assets. In the 11th position, with net worth of $1.1 billion, we have Fred Urshan. Urshan co-founded the cryptocurrency exchange Coinbase and left the company in 2017. However, he remains on the board and still owns about 6% of its stock on Nasdaq. He later co-founded Paradigm, which is a cryptocurrency investment firm with more than $1 billion worth in assets. Number 10 is Jed McCaleb, net worth $2.2 billion. McCaleb is a co-founder of Ripple, which he later left due to disagreements with fellow co-founders, and also Stellar, which is a Ripple competitor. Most of his wealth is from the estimated 3.4 billion XRP tokens that he still holds from the original 9 billion XRP that he pocketed as a Ripple co-founder. In the ninth position, we have Brian Armstrong with net worth of $3.1 billion. Brian Armstrong is the chief executive of Coinbase Global, the largest cryptocurrency exchange in the USA. Number eight is Barry Silbert net worth of $3.2 billion. Silbert is the founder and CEO of digital currency group DCG, a conglomerate of five cryptocurrency-focused companies. DCG's biggest revenue generator, digital asset manager Grayscale, which oversees $28 billion worth of Bitcoin Ether and other assets. If you're enjoying this video, smash up the like button and subscribe to the channel. Let's let the YouTube algorithm know that it's worth watching the video from this normal guy. Thanks, guys. Number seven is another Ripple billionaire, Chris Larson, net worth of $3.2 billion. Chris Larson is the current executive chairman and co founder of Ripple, which facilitates international payments for banks using blockchain technology. In the sixth position, we have Song Shi Hyun with net worth of $3.6 billion. Song Shi Hyun is the founder and chairman of Dunamu, South Korea's in dominant cryptocurrency exchange, currently worth $1 billion. 
Numbers 4 and 5 come together. They are the Winkle brothers. The Winkle Voss twins, famous for accusing Mark Zuckerberg of stealing their idea for social network, co-founded the cryptocurrency exchange Gemini. They both, they both own an estimate of about 70,000 BTC. Number 3 is Gary Wang with net worth of $5.8 billion. Wang is the co-founder and CTO of FTX Exchange, currently valued at $32 billion. The second richest crypto billionaire is Binance's CEO and founder, CZ. Binance is the largest crypto exchange in the whole world. And in the first position, we have another founder of a crypto exchange, Sam Bankman Fried. Interesting name, right? Uh, Sam is the founder of FTX, FTX Exchange, which is currently valued at $32 billion. You feel surprised for not having seen Michael Saylor's and Elon Musk's name on this list. Uh, probably the reason why they're not on this list is, is that because I am listing individuals that are crypto billionaires. Michael Saylor and Elon Musk uh, own Bitcoin, representing their companies, MicroStrategy, and Tesla. What is the trend there? We don't need to be too smart to figure out that most of these guys own crypto exchanges. So they make money everybody you buy, every time you sell, every time you're trading, they're making their trading fees. So regardless of the market conditions, they're making money. The more you trade, uh, the better for them. I hope you have enjoyed this video. If you have, don't forget to like, subscribe, activate the notification bell, and I will see you in the next video. Take care, guys. Bye-bye.